<laughs> it is Vlogmas Day 20, and I went to my oh, yes. appointment, oh, yes. and it's now odd. It's odd. I'm home. It's a good taquito. So I went to my appointment, got my ultrasounds, came home, and ate some food. And then now, have about an hour until I have to leave to go to work. Oh, yes. Luckily, I only have to work for two and a half hours today. And then, uh. And then I'm at my. And then, uh. I go to the gym. So. But I'm tired today. Very tired. Chiquito. Do you have something to say? I'm a dog. Do you have something to say? He's a dog. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> that good finger. You're like, this is a good finger. This is my finger. Nom, nom, nom. Nom, 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 I love you. I love you. Taquito. Hey, Taquito! Taquito! Ow. I love you too. Taquito! What are you doing? Hey, Taquito. Come here. Come here. Oh, you're so cute. Taquito. Taquito. Oh, there you are. Say hello. Taquito, say hello. Look, I'm a dog. Say hello. Hi. You gotta let me boop. No, you gotta let me boop you in, in the face. No. Here. Yeah. No. 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 Do you know I don't know any of those commands? No. <laughs> no. The boop. I'm gonna trap you in my dick. The boop. My legs. The boop. You're cute. You want a toy? <gasps> Go get it! That's right, bring it back. Nope. What up vlog? Went to work. Um, went to the gym on post. George came and joined me. We just got home. We're gonna eat pizza for dinner. And watch some, some Hulu. Um, but I did actually get a call um, from the doctor, the doctor this afternoon, she didn't get my ultrasound results yet. She basically was asking like, Hey, did you go get this done? Okay, and I said, yes. Um, and what? Set timer for 12 minutes. He's setting the timer. Hello. <laughs> but, um, so I did get a call from her. And she basically was like, okay, she's like a couple of things. She's like, I'm asking, like, she's like, did you get this done yet? And I said, yeah, I got it done this morning. And she said, oh, okay, good. And I said, yeah, they said you should have the results, um, you know, tomorrow. And she said, okay, that's good. Um, she's said that, you know, my pap smear came back normal. Um, but she said my labs did show, um, two enzymes that were elevated. Um, so the ultrasound should hopefully pinpoint that but because of like where those enzymes are generally located she's like was clarifying the fact that i'm not a heavy drinker like an alcoholic and i was like no because the enzymes are like liver and kidney related i guess so hopefully we'll have answers soon hopefully the ultrasound will show her what she needs to know but or at least let her know like further testing that needs to be done or something so i will let you guys know when I know something, but that's the update right now on my health. And now this taquito, what are you doing? What are you doing with your ball? Oh, I got your ball. I got your ball. Ready, and ball. Mm -hmm. He's so cute. Look at the ball. Okay, I'm, I'm going to let you go now, but that's the update. We're just going to relax tonight. And yes, so tomorrow is Friday. Thank goodness. Um... I work an eight hour day instead of a nine apparently. So I'm excited because I have a long weekend. I have a four day weekend because I have Christmas Eve off and Christmas. So I basically don't have to work until Wednesday. 
then I work Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then I have the weekend off again. So that's nice. Submitted my first time card today, so I'll be getting paid in like a week and a half. So that's exciting. And yes, that is the update. Do you have anything to say? Nope. He like, no. <laughs> nope, and he was shaking his head yes, because that makes sense. But yes. Keto. You you love me? Yeah. You like no, I like the ball. <laughs> what up guys? It's Vlogmas Day 21. I can't believe it's almost over. It is Friday. Christmas is on Tuesday. So I'm just getting ready for work. I hate wearing this thing, but it's required outside in the winter. So, yes, I'm going to work. It's a shorter day because it's Friday, so the Fridays that we don't have off are eight hour days instead of nine. So, then I'll go to the gym and everything, and then It'll be the weekend. Isn't that ex exciting? This is gonna be annoying. Okay, so I'm gonna put this on. Cause it's also required. And I'm gonna go to work. But I will see you guys when I get home. Hopefully the doctor will call me today. I'll let you know if she does. But yes, Tito is excited because he's getting my the rest of my eggs. That reminds me, I need to grab my lunch. So I would have been really mad if I dropped that. So, yes. I will see you guys when I get home or somewhere along the way. And, yes. George is in the process of making dinner. And I'm in the process of making some dessert. We are having some supreme triple chunk brownies. Because sometimes you just need brownies. They'll make me feel better. And the minute you mention brownies out loud, you kind of have to have brownies. Because they sound good. Right? Yeah. Ciao, Keith. No. I love you. Here I am on a Friday night at like 9 p.m. Snuggling with Takeda, watching some YouTube, and coloring in my Christmas coloring book. Hey, I'm not mad about it. That is what I'm doing tonight. And I will see you guys tomorrow. He's so very happy. Are you happy, baby doll? Are you so happy? Are you so happy? You look happy. You do. Yeah. I know, baby doll. Mm. Baby doll. Mm, baby doll. And this, this is the progress on my picture. Yeah, look at that. I know how to color in the lines. Go. Me. Yeah. Hey guys, really quick. I don't think I gave you guys a health update. Um, so the doctor did call me today. Um, and she said, weirdly enough, my abdominal ultrasound came back normal. Um, and she said that my pelvic ultrasound, though, did not. Um, they found, um, something in my, like she said, my right ovary. Um, so I have to wait about six to eight weeks. Go back in. Um, and, um, get another one done, um, to see if it's grown or whatever, um, and then to repeat my labs. I don't know if I told you guys, I think I did, but they found elevated levels, um, in my blood, so they want to make sure those have gone down, um, but that's the update. I won't know anything for, like, six to eight weeks, but, yes, meanwhile, I have to just... Suffer with the pain, but you know, we all gotta do what we gotta do. Hey guys, it's December 22nd. It's like uh, 8.55 in the morning. I have clothes on. I know, I'm actually wearing jeans. How weird is that? Um, but I have clothes on. I'm about to do my hair and makeup. And then I'm gonna go grab a few things for George for Christmas. Um, since it is Vlogmas Day 22nd, which means there's three days till Christmas, so I'm going to go do that. I was going to also go to the gym, but um, I'll either take a rest day or I'll just go to the gym after he gets home. But I'm going to go do that, and I will see you along the way. Alright guys, it's about 9.45 now, 
heading down on the elevator. I have the truck today because George took the car. And I'm gonna go do some Santa Claus business. All right guys, I'm in the truck and it's cold. But I have not driven the truck in a really long, like, probably like when we first moved here was the first time that I drove the truck. Well, like, not the first time, but the last time that I did. So, yeah, I did some makeup. Um, it's a lovely sound. But it's very cold in here. <laughs> so I'm gonna let it warm up a little bit and then I'm gonna head out. I would say it was a success. I had a fantastic idea for stuff to put in his stocking and I think it's gonna be hilarious. He'll think it's funny. So that's good. It's just full of like inside jokes and stuff. But I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna wrap the stuff for the stocking now. And then I mean, I have time to do the rest of the stuff, but I'm gonna do that now and just wait for him to get home. So I'm almost done with wrapping actually already. I just kind of got in the mood. But so I had seen um, that George had put um, stuff in my stocking and I didn't know we were doing stockings so I thought that was kind of cute so I got stuff for his stocking um, it's just kind of full of a bunch of like joke like, it's not really jokes but like I don't know just stuff that I thought was gonna be funny like I put little notes on them like one of them was like for your health and it was like just vitamins and then like um, there, I was gonna put the headphones because I bought him a pair of headphones because um, we neither of us like the ones that we have um, But they're not gonna fit so it's fine. There'll be more of the a bigger gift anyway um, So it's just like has some funny little things in it has like a couple little um, Little things of Bacardi in it um, What else like air fresheners for his car? Um, but yeah, just little things and then some socks for work. I can only fit three, so I'm going to wrap up the rest, um, with, I bought him, one of the things that I bought him today was, hold on, I'm trying to get him out of the bag, were these cool joggers. I thought they were cool, so I'll just wrap those together. Um, but I know how I told you guys that, like, he kind of figured out what his main gift was, um, but... We're gonna, I have to get it out of the box to wrap the actual box, but basically I got him something from Fuego Box. So, um, sorry, terrible angles. But basically he, people may think that's weird that that's like his big gift, but he loves hot sauce. Like I'm talking like he loves hot sauce. Um, so I thought it was really clever to get him like the one I got him is called the Crate of Death. And so it's literally like five or six bottles of like some of the hottest hot sauce in the world. But like the reason why it's the bigger gift is it's like literally $60 worth of hot sauce. So, and I knew he would love it. It was really funny. He's like, he's like actually figured out what it was. Only because somebody at his work was making homemade hot sauce because he works in the kitchen. And he goes, oh my God, I know what she bought me. So... He figured it out, but that's fine. He's he's still like he's stoked about it, and he'll he'll love it. Um, but he told somebody what what I got him. Like he doesn't know exactly what I got him. Like he doesn't know what box or anything, but he knows that it's hot sauce. And somebody was like, "Oh my God, you're really easy. Like all she bought you was hot sauce. Granted, I bought him more than that." And he goes, "Yeah, she knows me really well." <laughs> He goes, because I would love that. And they're like, wow, I wish my husband was that easy because like, oh, he wants a tablet and all this stuff. And it's like, my husband just wants to create a hot sauce. Like, that's it. So, here's the box. Comes with some cards and stuff. I'll leave all that stuff in there. And then there is the crate. I'm not, I don't know how easy it is going to be to open. Let me see. Because I don't want to like, you know, open it, ruin his gift. But, um, dang. This is like a legit crate. It's kind of awesome. Bam. It's literally a giant crate. I think the lid just slides off. Let me see. Yeah, it has stuff on the top. So I'm not gonna like actually open it because I want to save that for him, but basically it has hot sauce in it. So yes, that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna finish wrapping his gifts and then I'm done. So we're having uh, pork chops for dinner and uh, I let George open his hot sauces because why not? 
So here's what they look like. There was one more right there. But like even just the labels and stuff, like those look hot. Like really hot. Let's do a taste test of this one. Which one's, what's one's this? Which one's this? This is the Exidum Pepper Ginger Hot Sauce. All right. Stick your little finger in there. Let's get a reaction of how hot this one is. Yeah, they all say refrigerate after opening. I don't know if they all say it, but well, um, that one does. All right. Stick your little finger in there. See how hot it is. You gonna die? Maybe? It's called the Crate of Death. It's what this box was. <laughs> it's not too bad? No, it's not, like, horrible. I mean, you would say this is, like, extremely It's hot, hot, but not, like... That may be the lowest one out of all of them. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. It's good, though. I mean, it's hot. Yum. Update. It was hotter than he thought. So it was apparently the second one in the box. Um, and he was like, his nose was extremely running. So it's one of those where like, after like, I mean, this is a little taste test. It's not bad, but like when you're actually like eating it, you're like, oh my god, my mouth is on fire. Yes. So that's the update. Good morning. Happy Christmas Eve Eve. Taquito, do you have anything to say about that? Do you? What do you have to say? What do you have to say? Nothing? You like nudging? Just chilling. Totally like slept into like 10 in the morning. I have not done that in a long time. Granted, I did go to bed at like 12.30. But I still slept, still sleeping in. I'm just chilling. I'm just chilling, Tikito. I'm just chilling here with the baby dog. Waiting for George to come home. Yeah. And we're probably going to go to the gym. Or something. We went grocery shopping yesterday. Yep. That's what we did. And uh, here's another shot of the baby doo. Being cute. Being cute. And that's it. Hey guys, we're at the gym now. Doing back and shoulder day. So here's some workout clips. You're welcome. Thank you.
the end of the vlog. I will see you guys in the next one. Sorry, it was a several day combined, but not really doing anything.